Hello everyone, I am Tisha Bu. I teach English reading for grade 11. And today we are going to learn a reading strategy called summarizing. Summarizing. A summary is a brief statement containing the most important in the text. To summarize the text, first, find the main ideas, then put them together to make the summary. You should not include specific details or examples. To make a summary, you must know what are the most important facts in the text. A good summary identifies the writer of the original text, synthesizes the writer's key ideas, presents the information neutrally. When we read a story, we need the events of the story in an order, the character, the problems they face. Let's take a look at the example of making a good summary. Let's summarize the story of three little pigs. The main characters are three pigs and a big bad wolf. Three pigs build three houses of different materials. A big bad wolf blows down the first two pigs' houses made of straw and sticks, but is unable to destroy the third pigs' house made of bricks. See, it is not difficult. Let's practice. Read the text, then use the strategy to choose the summary. There will be four pages. You may pause the video to finish each page and continue. Let's get started. Page 1 Page 2 Page 3 Page 4 Alright, now when you finish reading the story Tell me, which is the best summary of the passage? Number 1, 2 or 3? Yes, the answer is number one. For a number of reasons, Korean dramas have become a big hit all around the world and are a major part of the Korean wave. Among the most important reasons are traditional themes and positive, helpful message. Very good. All right, everyone, before we end this lesson, remember when reading, summarize what you read by getting the most important facts from the text. Practice reading every day and you will become a good reader. Lapuan my episode na na ka sa di ka.